This next story, everybody, is an amazing discovery where art and animals collide into an early period Picasso painting. And if you ask me, I think it's a fantastic <laughs> surprise. It's a small dog painted over by the artist himself. Now the painting is housed at the Guggenheim Museum in New York City. Julie Barton is the museum's senior painting conservator. She made the discovery through a high-tech process called X-ray fluorescence imaging spectroscopy. Mm -hmm. But she, to find it though, she had to know where to look. Looking at this area where you can see other colors peeking through, and you can see texture that doesn't relate to the final composition, I had a very strong feeling that there was something under there. We, we think that it looks like um, some kind of a king, maybe a, a cavalier King Charles Spaniel. That would be very timely with all the King Charles Spaniels that we just saw at the coronation. So this discovery unveils yet another layer of what's considered to be a masterpiece. Oh. It's uh, at the center of the young Picasso in Paris exhibition, which is right now a worldwide celebration mm. marking 50 years. That doesn't sound right since Picasso's death. It doesn't, but I believe that is may that be accurate. Right? Yes. Okay. Um, right. I've lost track of time. That's okay. No, I'm just thinking you and I need to hop a plane to Paris. Well, I, you with me? I, I, to go look What's at dogs, weather? yes, I will <laughs> do that. To go look at dogs, yes, I would do that. I love that this painting, a masterpiece, no doubt yes. it's been looked at millions of times. Yes. Someone just thought, you know what, let's put it under a big fancy microscope and they found something new. Like, Isn't what are the that odds? cool? Yeah, what just, are the odds? You know, he, he knew it was there and it was there to find and she finally found it. Pretty and we neat. did too. And now you know too.